Welcome to the BetQL Daily Boost. I'm Lucy Burge of BetQL.com and I'm joined by Kate Constable and we have an NBA odds boost for all of you today on the Knicks to win and Julius Randle to have over 24 and a half points. This is boosted to plus 275 at Caesars. Kate, what do we think about this boost? I think of all the boosts that we've done lately, I really like this one. Plus 275, that's some great value here because Julius Randle started the season very slow in terms of his shooting percentages, his scoring, but he's picked things up as of late. So I wonder if maybe the markets just kind of hasn't quite caught up to that yet. But Julius Randle has been averaging 24 and a half points per game over his last four games. So right at this mark. Uh, playing the Hawks tonight, they're on the road. Randall actually plays three more minutes on average on the road, so clearly more opportunities for him to be on the floor and scoring. And earlier this season, even though he was struggling, uh, the Knicks and Hawks met in the Knicks' second game of the season. Randall shot 49% or just under 49% from three uh, against the Hawks in that game. Plus, Hawks are on a back-to-back. Uh, after playing last night, and Trey Young missed last night because he had a baby. So I don't oh, know. Oh, congrats if he's to him! Be. Yes, congrats to Trey and his baby mama. Um, hope they're doing well. Um, but he, he, I don't know if he's gonna play again tonight. Like I, they're, the Hawks are at home, so maybe that works out. I don't, you know, I don't know what all he's dealing with being a, a new dad. Um, but there's a chance he doesn't, and if that's the case, you know. He's a major player on, on that team. Uh, that just kind of opens the door a little bit more for the Knicks. Plus, the Knicks are already favored in this game. So, you have Randall putting up a, a number that he's basically averaging on the season. Knicks to win when they're already favored, plus 275. I think this is a pretty good boost for today, Lucy. Yes, seems like the stars are aligning for this boost. There's a lot to like about this. Plus 275 at Caesars. Get in on that and get up to $1,500 back in bonus bets on your first wager at BetMGM by entering code Lucy1000 when you sign up for a new BetMGM account now. And head to BetQL.com. Get your free three-day trial today. And check out our exclusive sportsbook offers there as well. And, of course, follow us on X at Kate Constable and at Lucy. Seal Burge. We have our favorite bets for today. My favorite bet today is absolutely South Florida minus 17 and a half against Central Michigan. A game of the day, I would say. South Florida is average. I'm so pumped for this. They're averaging 96 points scored per game. Central Michigan is averaging 63 points scored per game. So I think South Florida has a great chance here to cover this spread, especially since Central Michigan lost by 30 points in their first game of the season. South Florida won by 30. 30 in their first game and only game so far this season. So I think they'll put up a lot of points today and limit Central Michigan scoring. So South Florida minus 17 and a half. Uh, Lucy, you laugh backing South Florida. Uh, I am backing Louisville tonight, which yes. is a disgusting play because how bad has Louisville been over the last year? I mean, this is just gross, but I am not going to back them to cover the spread because they have not been great at covering at all. I'm going to back their team total to go over 83 and a half. They're playing Coppin State, who's significantly worse. The Eagles rank 361 in offense, 346 on defense. That's according to Ken Palm. But keep in mind, there are only 362 teams in all of college basketball. So they are the second worst offensive team in the entire nation. I think the Cardinals, I mean, their offense is much better. 21 in offensive rebounding percentage. So they're going to get a ton of offensive boards. Second chance opportunities. Louisville's also 59 in free throw attempts per game. So ton of freebies at the line with the clock stop. That's always great for an over. Um, and Ken Palm and Bartorvik are both projecting that Louisville's going to win by 20 and score 86 points. So we're getting a little bit of a buffer on the 83 and a half for their team total. Uh, so I'll take the over on that. I love that. Get in on all of these bets and the odds boost plus 275 at Caesars and subscribe to the BetQL Daily Boost wherever you get your podcasts.